Hello there, my name is Ben Wade, and I'd like to welcome you to this installment of Bionic U, the series dedicated to lighting the path to your full potential. In this video, you're going to take a tour of your newly installed WordPress website and learn how to control everything from the dashboard. We'll get into how that happens right after this. In this video, you are going to take a tour of your WordPress dashboard. This is where you operate, change, and control everything that your site does. So this is one of the sites that we installed in the last video as, an, as a sample example. If you look up here at sampleinstall1.whoisbenway.com. Now you can go down here to the site and click on Login. And it'll take you to this login page or from any point anywhere, if you want to get to your login page, all you have to do right here is add forward slash wp-login.php, and this will take you to the same page. So go ahead and use the username and password that you set up. So this is your dashboard in your site. And it's going to have a few pop-up messages that come along with your new install. Go ahead and dismiss those. These links down here are not a bad idea to look through. They are a few tutorial things to get you started as well, and they're not too bad. And definitely as many things as you can do to get familiar is a good idea. But on a regular day-to-day -day basis, this is how your site's going to look. And it's got a few options here in the middle. You can move these around. They are drag and drop, so all you have to do is mouse over this little gray area, drag it and move it to rearrange the inside of your dashboard. Over here on the left-hand side, this is where all your controls sit. So creating posts, adding media, which is pictures or videos, creating links, pages, managing the comments that have been left on your site, your appearance options, adding plugins, managing users, different types of tools, and your various settings, all those options are on the far left hand side. The other thing to keep in mind is right up here. This little button you're going to use a lot because when you're in your dashboard it'll take you back out to your site. When you're on your site it'll take you back into your dashboard. So that's an easy way to move back and forth. You're going to use that a lot, especially when you're logged in and you're working on your site and you're checking on the changes that you just made. The other thing is up over here in the top right-hand corner. You can edit your profile or log yourself out right here from this button as well. Now, this is the general idea of the dashboard, and you're going to be coming here a lot to manage your site. The really nice thing about this is because this is all web-based, you can access this from anywhere. So if you're on vacation or you're working out somewhere remote, as long as you have an internet connection, you can log in and manage your site. And that's one of the really nice things about WordPress is it doesn't require any special software for you to do the work on this. You don't have to lug around a laptop that has all your software loaded up, none of that. As long as you can access the internet, you can work on your site. So to wrap things up, in this video, you took a tour of your WordPress dashboard and became familiar with the various controls and functions. Now, if you're watching the video in the whoisbenway.com members area, look on the page below the video you're watching right now. As often as possible, you will find links to additional information that will help you expand on what you just learned. And remember, if you thought this information was helpful, be sure to click that like button or favorite button so other people can find it too. And click that subscribe button so you'll never miss out whenever a new video comes out. However, the real gold mine is the members area of whoisbenway.com. That's where you'll find tons of videos like this one laid out step by step and organized so everything's easy to find. Thank you so much for watching.